Hello, my fellow viewers, subscribers, and this is Super Truck About Shake, and I am here talking about a game I had to disqualify for the Shake It Up Jam. It is a game that is called What the Hell. Now, to give you a little bit of a reasoning why I disqualified this game, primarily it has something to do with the fact that really all the game is is just a HTML file that contains a jump scare. That's it. There's nothing more to it. There's no gameplay mechanics. There's nothing. It has nothing to do with fighting or management. Actually, tell you the truth, I actually put a criteria that says, how did you follow the theme? And the guy only said, I make horror game for you. Yeah, that clearly goes to show how well he thought this out. Considering that basically the theme this year was about fighting and management and trying to combine the two very ideas together. But of course, um, uh, I actually had to ask him personally myself, about that, yes, he made a horror game, but this is not the Scare Me Shakeless Jam, so how does this fit into the two themes that I chose to combine, which was fighting and management? And then he just responded with, because I code to game. Yeah, I immediately disqualified him right then and there. I left him a comment on his game saying that, I'm sorry, not only did you fail to meet the requirements of the Shake It Up Jam, but this game is nothing more than just a jump scare. It pains me to disqualify your game from the running of the Shake It Up Jam, but this needed to be done. I wish you nothing but luck on your journeys as a game dev, and I hope you continue to improve your craft. But then again, also looking at the comment section for the game as well, actually, the he also entered in another game jam. And actually, he entered in two other game jams, probably hosted by the exact same person. He got into a little bit of a confusing, a confusing conversation, saying that he should have been submitting to one or the other. And then, of course, he was confusing on which one he wanted to stay in. So clearly, this guy clearly does not know what he's doing, and I don't know if he really knows how to read very well. But, unfortunately, from the game jam that he did get stuck into, he also got kind of disqualified from that as well. So, um, I am very sorry to disqualify that game. And, honestly, I really wish it wouldn't come down to the part where I would have to disqualify the games. But, first of all, since the Shake It Up jam is not a very big jam right now, and there was, like, only five games posted to the Shake It Up jam this year, it was very easy to weed out a game that needed to be disqualified. So, I am very sorry to disqualify the game, and I'm very sorry that I have to be in a position to disqualify the game. I'm pretty sure you did put a little bit of work into it. I'm pretty sure of it. And I hope you continue to prove your craft, and I hope you continue to become a much better game dev and develop games that you would like to play and that other people would love to play. Okay? And I really hope that you also get that gameplay element working in there and also work on making the game a little bit more fun for other people and, you know, just doing things that you need to do. Okay, I know, I'm not very... <laughs> I know, I'm not being very organized in my thoughts, but personally, this is why I had to disqualify the game. So, yeah, to the person I disqualified, I wish you luck on your future endeavors, Okay. I wish you luck, and I really hope that you continue to improve upon your cast, hopefully making an actual game and not just a file that contains a jump scare. So, anyway, I guess that's all I have to say. Don't worry, I do have four games to cover, and I'm probably going to have a bit of a full week of uploading videos here. So, if you like this video, please be sure to hit that like button, don't forget to subscribe, and comment down below, and I'll see you all in the next video. This is Super Taco Milkshake, signing off!